What is up? Good morning, good day to you. Today's the big day, Demo the Hustler. So, uh, we're gonna see how this goes, I guess. And I'm super stoked, super stoked, super excited. So uh, let's get this day rolling. Let's get you some footage. Uh, we're gonna meet with the Hustler rep. Um, that's probably when the video is gonna start. And uh, so I'm gonna go do some mowing, meet up with the, the Hustler rep at my dealer, and then uh, go mow with it for hour and a half, two hours, whatever I think they said. Uh, you know, he let me use it for three, three hours or so. So, my cool. So let's go check it out. I got my hustler shirt on. I'm, I'm hoping. I'm hoping, guys. We'll see what it's about. So uh, let's jump on and let's get rolling. There she is, boys. So it sticks out a little bit past this tire and uh, maybe a little bit over here. We'll see how this overlap uh, is going to work because with the grandstand, it sticks out a little farther, but it may also feel like that because I've got twills on it as well. And the twills seem to be uh, smaller, um, you know, uh, width wise. Now these, as you can tell, it's almost like the uh, Ferris mower with these smaller wheels but uh we're gonna see how it holds heels and you know so we'll get you some footage of it this this is what you've been waiting on right here this is what i've been waiting on right here so uh we're gonna talk to the rep here we're gonna go over some information with you on this and uh man i like these uh these rims here but on the 52 the rims are way uh you know the, the tires are wider on the 52 i wish i could fit a 52 through my gates for sure, I damn wish I could, but uh, you know, there's there's no way of having everybody switch their gate around. And a 48 will definitely fit. So, you know, let's uh, let's talk to the rep here, go over some things on this, and answer maybe some of your questions, and then we'll show you how this bad boy cuts and runs and everything else. All right, guys. So let's go over this thing. I don't know if you can see me personally or not, but uh, so this has the FX 691, the 22 horsepower, just like the the Toro does over there. Um, smaller wheels, like I said, than the than the 52 inch. Uh, we're gonna find out how well we like those things. Um, I, like I said, I wish I could get a 52 because the the wheels base is wider. Seems like it might possibly hold a hill better. But uh, maintenance free spindles on this, which is great. Uh, the new VX deck, so, you know, they've opened this thing up. Uh, better disbursement in dry, wet, you know, pretty much all conditions is their, their thing for this. Um, I think we said we got six grease fittings on this, two of them being up front here in the uh, uh, caster wheels and uh, for your bearings. And then I'm not sure where the other four are, but we'll figure all this out. Seven and a half gallon fuel tank on this uh, the brake is you know one that goes against the wheel here uh, so um, 12 cc hydro pumps yes sir uh, nine and a half miles an hour forward yep. what, what will it go backwards I would say roughly about four four and a half oh really yeah. <clears throat> so pretty quick going back so for all y'all that hate the grandstand because I know I hate it with a passion it's just so slow going in reverse uh, so you know best of both worlds on this um, what else do we got? Uh, okay, go for it. What, what would you, uh, maintenance on the hydros, uh, ever 500? Is that what it, or the first, do yeah, they recommend do the first, first? Yeah, yeah, a little bit of a break in there. Um, and then, yeah, every, you know, every, I'd like to say every, you know, depending on how many hours you put in a year. Okay. Know, in there, every, um, oil changes, easy to do guys. Yeah. On this, they made it to where you can set your, your uh, pan right underneath this on the deck or whatever down here loosen this right here and you know drain your oil very very easy so i like that because you know the grandstand even though i can get to it pretty easy it's got that hose and that hose don't like to stay downward uh but this they already got set up for you so um i don't know uh you got anything for us I this thing like goes it. up to five and a half inches most mowers go to five uh, this one goes from I think one and a half all the way up to five and a half inch cut um, Or transport height may be five and a half, but uh, regardless, I mean We're gonna see we're gonna get definitely it, gonna see get it dirty and see what you think <clears throat> well, We're gonna do it. So uh, 
I don't know about dirty. It's not really wet, but we'll, we'll see. Uh, Cause I've got them heels that you know y'all know are side by side, and I've waited uh, and put them off until I could get this demo right here to see how well it's going to hold heels because the Toro don't hold them at all. Uh, going up, especially that's my biggest thing is you know sometimes you know, I got to stripe different directions and one of them's going up that hill there, and so uh, I know the 52 held a hill real nice when I put it back here behind uh, Lumax. We're gonna see if the 48 holds just as well. So uh, let's get rolling guys. Let's get you some footage of this bad boy and uh, let's, let's go from there. So uh, I'll give you my thoughts, opinions once we drop this off back to him. That way he can hear everything as well. And uh, you know, until then, hey, we'll, we'll figure it out. So let's roll with it. All right, what do y'all think? Does it look good? I mean, I don't know. Uh, <clears throat> them little wheels are gonna scare me. Uh, but you know, this is normally a property I would do with the 61, but uh, seeing as though <clears throat> I've knocked majority of all of them out the other day with the, the 61, uh, I saved a lot just to see how this mower is going to disperse, cut, and everything else. So, uh, we're going to set you up probably on the other side of the sidewalk over there is where I'm guessing the best place would be, but we will see. Uh, I'll probably make a stripe, see which direction it looks better from, and then uh, come back to you. So let's uh, let's get this knocked down and see how this thing cuts on the first property. All right, let's go. Let me know what's your first impressions. Let's move on, but I want to know what are your first impressions as of right now. All right, let's see how it straps weed grass. At least that's what I pretty much call this, but uh, let's find out here.
right there. You can't tell. But uh yeah, let's move on. I'm a man on a mission.